For months, Sassy Jackson of Sacramento has only made partial rent payments after losing her job during the pandemic. It's making me depressed, you know, because I can't provide for my family like I need to. I can't pay bills. As she looks for work, she fears she'll be homeless again. Being evicted, yeah, I'm, I'm afraid of that. In an effort to prevent evictions, a California bill proposes giving tenants 10 years to make up unpaid rent and landlord renter agreements. The state would take over unpaid rent in the form of tax credits, which homeowners can sell to investors for cash flow. Tenants would agree to repay in monthly installments starting in 2024, interest free if paid on time. Though lawmakers haven't given a cost estimate for the plan. Democrat State Senator Anna Caballero introduced the bill. She said in a statement, the reality is that we do not have enough housing units of any type in California and cannot risk families losing their existing housing as they try to re-enter the workforce. The bill needs to get through committee and both legislative houses and Jackson hopes it's approved. It'll give you know, uh, us time to be able to catch up and start over. Some warn of evictions for the most vulnerable, like Jackson. According to apartment lists, young, low-income city renters who can't work from home are among the hardest hit and most concerned about losing their homes. Sacramento's rent COVID-related eviction moratorium is still in effect. Tenants have until November 25th to pay back rent before being evicted. The statewide order runs through July 28th.